Hi, it's Aliana Gleek. Today we're going to talk about systems thinking from our entrepreneurship module. So why is systems thinking important? And you know, what is it? It's really just looking at patterns from past information or from uh, processes and using that to really kind of predict um, uh, the future of something, right? So systems thinking, you know, if you do it right, you can actually predict sales. You can actually, with, you know, a fair amount of accuracy. Now, there are certain types of frameworks that are needed for systems thinking to really kind of work. So first of all, you know, um, the first part of systems thinking is, you know, the understanding that everything is not dis disconnected, but interconnected. You know, that's, that's you're, remember you're looking for patterns. So you're looking for the interconnectedness of everything. Things are not linear, they're circular. So um, everything has a cause and effect on something else. Things are not in silos. They actually have to come together to emerge into something else. Um, it's never parts, it's the whole, right? Uh, when you're looking from a systems thinking uh, lens. Um, it's not analysis, but synthesis. Again, looking at things together. And nothing is ever in isolation. It's really all about relationships. And when you look at um, a business, a product, you know, with this system, a problem, with this systems thinking hat, you then can create the end product, which is, which is a systems thinking map, because you've really kind of looked at how things interrelate and impact each other and the causality of things. You know, when this happens, this happens. When this happens, that happens. And that is when you really know that you've done systems thinking right. Let's practice below.